And let's look at the update call really quick. Yeah, so it uses a spring force with the children. That's irrelevant to us. But if you see, we're doing a subtraction from our position to the child position. So this means the child has the absolute um, coordinates. Otherwise, this would be meaningless. Yeah, and that's, I think, the way to go. Because when we want to separate the entity, we just separate it and add it to the top level. Okay, so... Hard to say what we need. Maybe I should make this a physics entity. I'm not sure. Advantage of... Let's look at normal physics entities so we see what we get for free. There's definitely the draw children call, which helps. Oops. No, there is no draw children. Hmm. I guess that was defined in subclasses. The actual drawing behavior is, for example, sign sound. No sign block. So yeah, it defines its own draw self. I don't see the draw children. Ah, I bet draw children is in. Is it a normal uh, filter entity? Okay, this is the draw call. Yeah, it just pushes and then draws the children in a separate loop after. No, I think this comes irrelevant. Alright, so there's definitely a lot of stuff here. There is not really collision detection. Yeah, and for that reason, I think I want to go with normal physics entity. So what's another one that does normal physics entity? I believe the uh, snakeable entity does that. No, effects entity does that. Right? Yeah. Yeah, and it's possible we want to move those belts around at one point. Okay, so these are definitely going to use the user interactable call. Yeah. Um, but I don't think we define those here. Anyway, that's not that important. I want to check though. Noise block is the only. No, that's not true. For example, the shooter. Yeah. So you have to define. You have to mention that you are user interactable, something like 
I believe it's protocols. Java, the interfaces, here the protocols. Yeah, I believe that's right. So let me set a goal because I think this is going to be a very long, this is going to take a couple days. And that's okay. Uh, I wasn't just lying around. Um, I want to get the belt entry on the screen. With one. with one entity in it. Now I want to get yeah, three belts on the screen with these three guys. That's all I want for now. That's the minimum for today. And they should work I don't need this actually. This can just be a wall for now. This can be an exit gate. This doesn't have to be a speaker. But these two for sure. Yeah, so that's the first test. Alright, so the other thing is the rotation from landscape to uh, portrait to landscape. I don't know if it's an issue or not. I don't think it is because our objects work vertically as well. But currently, uh, this is still the Y component and this is still the X component. I think it's okay. We can just ignore that for now and treat them backwards. I mean, there's nothing special about the letter X and Y. Yeah, so, um, yeah, of, we're going to need a vector, so, What were we in? Snakeable. No, it was another class. Yeah, this one. This one has a lot of good stuff. stuff we could potentially use. Yes, these are the only calls that we actually need. We do want the draw children call. Whoa. Weird. Okay. 
don't need buffers, we don't need sounds, we might need entities. We've got we've already got normal physics entity. So this vector. This vector can be just filter entity. Can that just be filter entity? Yeah. Yeah, we can switch on type to figure out if it's an input or output object. The other thing is, because these aren't going to be in the graph, huh. thinking, thinking, thinking. These aren't in the graph. The touch to shoot thing won't work anymore because we just look in the game state array. And these won't be in the game state anymore. They'll be a child of an entity in the game state. We could query for all children. Or we could, the other option is to add these individual items to the game state. and just have a special flag so they don't move. Hmm. No, I want them to be fast stuck to the belt. Oh. Details. M sub Built entities. Not just entities, this is the built class. I'm not going to do this instance num thing, not for a built. Okay. So we will need a draw children call as well. I believe that's the signature. <laughs> Getting sleepy. Yeah. But it's probably because I'm lazy. Once I start coding, I get sleepy. To find a way to deal with that. Okay, so we'll take the init with boss, sure. We'll take what we can and the dialog. Yep. Yeah, so what I can do is. Uh, I don't need any of those. I mean, I will need this. Yeah. We will need the add call. adds one to the belt. 